What rotten luck this is, stuck in the sweltering doldrums without a single gust of breeze. Oh, don't be so quick to speak, Captain. Luck's got nothing to do with it. Oh? How do you mean? Well, what we found ourselves in is not simply a bit of bad luck, but the intertropical convergence zone, an area of low pressure that runs through the middle of the tropics. This intertropical convergence zone, or ICZ for short, is formed by two atmospheric cells called Hadley cells, one over the northern tropics and the other over the southern tropics. Hadley work is mainly thanks to this boiling hot sun overhead. The sun shines on the equator more directly and for more time throughout the days than anywhere else, so it gets really hot here. Huh, you can say that again. Well, since hot air rises, the air above the equator is almost always going up, what we call a low pressure zone. As it rises, it cools, forming clouds and rain and storms. It also begins to move away from the equator as more rising hot air pushes it from behind. Pretty soon, the cooling air moving away from the equator becomes cool enough to sink down again, creating what we call a high pressure zone. As it lowers and gets closer to the earth, it begins to heat up again and begins a return journey to the center of the tropics to do the cycle all over again. But that's why there's no wind here. The low pressure zone is making all the wind head straight up. That's a great story and all, but I've definitely traveled these seas before without any bad luck. That's because the ICZ isn't really straight, and it's not in the same place at different times of year. Okay, but how come I've experienced these doldrums much further up north before, like 30 degrees north? Hmm. Because of that high pressure zone he just mentioned. By the time the air has reached about 30 degrees north or south, the air has used up just about all of its moisture and has cooled enough to start sinking. They're called the horse latitudes. Their colder, dry air is sinking, and so there's basically no wind and barely any rain. Tis a cursed place. You mean a geographically inconvenient place. Oh, of course. Well, great. That actually makes a lot of sense. So what does that mean for us? So we're basically stuck. Yeah, yeah, we're basically stuck. <laughs>